this YouTube channel. Students, today we discuss about the mathematic part two of the standard nine. The first chapter is basic concepts in geometry. Student, first I will introduce about this geometry. Geometry means the, this is the word come from the Latin word geo plus metria. Geo means earth and metria means the measurements. Means that earth measurement is the geometry. Now we discuss some important points of the geometry also. Now first one is I have to repeat the word geometry is generated from the Greek word geo means earth, zami, bu. Metria means measuring. मतलब ज़मीनी चीज़ मोज़मा जी तंत्र आए तेल अपन geometry में the basic concepts in geometry which are these basic concepts already you are familiar with this now we we know that point line and plane are some basic concepts in geometry which do not define we accept as a true here we cannot define this point line and plane then next one is lines and planes are sets of points lines and planes are the sets of points the next point is coordinate of points and their distance the number associated with a point on the number line is called as the coordinate now here is i have to draw one line here the number is 0 1 2 minus 1 and minus here is the points A, B, C, D and E. For example here, the coordinates of point A is 0 and point E is minus 2. That is the point B is 1, point C is 2 etc. Then between this. If A, B, C are 3 distinct collinear points, means that these 3 points lie on the same line. There are three possibilities with the three conditions of Shakta, Shakta, or Shakta. First one is that point B is in between point A and C. Now we draw one line, point B is in between A and C. Symbolically we write that A dash B dash C. Means that we read as B is in between A and C. The possibility second is point C is between A and B. This line shows A dash C dash B. Symbolically, we write A dash C dash B. In third case, this point A is in between B and C. Draw the line. The point A is in between B and C. Symbolically, we write B dash A dash C. Now, so then, the distance between these two points. We can find out if we take this in between this property A dash B dash C, then distance of AC is equal to distance of AB plus distance of BC. Distance of AC is equal to distance of AB plus distance of BC. Then it is said that point B, B is between A and C, that is A dash B dash C or C dash B dash A also. Then line segment. Now this is the line segment AB. The union of set of point A and B. The union of set of the point A and B. And point between A and B. Point between A and B is called as the segment AB or set AB. Or else you have to write as set BA. The distance between the end points, the distance between the end point of the segment is called as the length of that segment. The length of the segment AB is written as length of AB. This is the basic concepts of the geometry. We take the next practice set first 1.1. Students, we see about the practice set 1.1. The first question is find the distance with help of the number line given below. This is the number line. 
it is minus 5 minus 4 minus 3 minus 2 minus 1 0 1 2 3 4 and 5 and up to 6 here is the number 0 associated with the point o then a b c d e and here j k p and q we can find out the distance between b distance of j distance of p c distance of j h distance of k o distance of o e distance of p j distance of q student we know that we can find out the distance between any two point from subtracting the smaller number from bigger I mean that's you have to subtract smaller coordinate from bigger coordinate so first I have to take the first sub question of this one is answer of the first answer first to find to find distance of Less than 3. 
So therefore distance of PC is equals to we subtract the smaller coordinate from the bigger coordinate means that P minus minus 4. Then minus minus plus 3 plus 4 means that distance of PC is equals to how much unit? 7 unit. When you observe this number line at that time there is also the distance is 7 unit. Look here this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. Then we take next sub question, question number 4. To find the value of distance of JH. Now then write the coordinate of point. Student. 
equals to minus 4 and y is equals to minus 1. Then x is the coordinate of point A, therefore the coordinate. Therefore, the points, the points P, Q, 
your second sub question here. Distance of R S is eight. Distance of S T is six. Distance of R T is four. Now here is also the bigger segment is R S. So in its solution, first I have write distance of R S is how much eight unit. Then distance of S T is equal to six unit and distance of R T is equal to four unit. This is given. Now student, I have write here this segment is greater R S. So this is our equation number first. Then sum of these remaining two segments means that S T plus distance of R T is equal to six plus four becomes This is equation number second. Observe equation first and second from equation first and second. The observation is that A is not equals to ten. Means that distance of R S is not equals to distance of S T plus distance of R T. Means that if these two segments, two, two distance and these additions are not equal, then these three points are not collinear so that the answer is the points 